guys, it's not quite Tyler with the Bears Den this week, but it is her friend Michaela. Um, Tyler asked me to film a day in the life of me. I think she's going to be doing a new little series with um, me and some of her other friends, so stay tuned for that. Today is going to kind of be um, a busy day for me. I am a sports reporter, so today is going to be filled with classes and sports reporting. And the main bulk of my day is going to be filled with um, producing the basketball tab for the standard. So stick around and you're going to see what it's like to live a day in my life. Well, we are in class. This is my good friend, Oshela. We have class together and we also uh, work at the standard together. We do. Um, we just had to work on stand-ups. Um, yeah. They had to be creative stand-ups. <laughs> um, they were a little bit goofy. They were. But uh, you know, everybody has to learn somewhere. Yeah. So, and that's what we're doing. So thanks, Horton. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that class is over. Um, my next thing on my agenda for today is my peer leader class. I'm a peer leader for a GEP class on Monday and Wednesday mornings. So now I'm going to do that. Shout out to Miss Heather Booth and her class. Um, thank you guys for taking me in. I've had a really lovely time this year. So the people that know me in my family know that I love Hamilton. And so this morning I got an email from Juanita K. Hammonds Hall. I was like, hey, pre-sales start today. I was like, oh cool, that means in a couple days I'll be able to get my tickets. So I ended up clicking on the email just to see what day I could get my tickets from and it gave me a special pre-sale code and I was like hmm interesting so I like go through like the stuff just to see how much tickets were I use the pre-sale code and it's like gonna let me buy tickets so I was like oh interesting okay and so now I have two wonderful tickets to Hamilton and then I cannot wait. I am so excited. Me and my sister are gonna go and I am just so excited for March. We are finishing up some page design. This is a little sneaky peeky of what's going on here. I just had a cookie. It was really good. Did you make them, Lillian? Shout out Lillian. Lillian is our editor-in-chief, as well as a great baker and chef. Oh, I can't <laughs> Okay, as a great baker then. So yeah, I guess I ought to get back to it before she fires me. One eternity later. Okay, it is now 5.20 at night. It's literally like nighttime outside. We are wrapping up page design and editing and all that jazz to get the basketball tab up and ready to go on Wednesday. Um, make sure you pick up a copy. You know, I gotta, gotta self promo there. And I am getting ready to head out to cover the first Lady Bears game of the season over at good old Great Southern Bank Arena. <laughs> All right, I'm here with my friend Nicole. She also writes in the standard with me. Um, we are currently both at the Lady Bears basketball game tonight. Um, we are super excited. We have our new press passes for this season. Very nice. And tonight is the home opener, so. We're kind of just getting a feel of how everybody's playing, what the lineup's gonna be. So far, it seems like it's gonna be an exciting season. Okay, I am finally back to my car. The Lady Bears um, unfortunately fell tonight. They were not able to keep up with the Missouri Tigers, but I saw a lot of untapped potential for the Missouri State team. So I'm actually looking for it to be a really, really positive season, a really hopeful season. They've got a lot of good guards, um, a lot of people that can shoot. I'm expecting it to be a really good season for the Lady Bears. I am gonna call it a day here. So thank you guys for watching. Watching. I hope I wasn't too boring. I hope you guys learned something about me, whether that be just in my regular old daily life type stuff, or if I even inspired you to come to a basketball game or something. Um, I hope you enjoyed, and just thanks for watching. Whoa, this is so fun. Hey, is this thing on? <laughs>